Hey, it's JC here at JC's Comics and More, your pop culture superstore. 6725 West Central Avenue. That is Toledo, Ohio, 4361741931609. JC's Comics and More.com, JC's Comics More at Hotmail.com. Like to uh, give a big shout out to all the everybody that took advantage of my big anniversary sale uh, ended this past Sunday. Like to give a shout out to Angela and all her all her purchases of the Fantastic Four. I certainly appreciate that. You got yourself a lot of really good books and you saved some good money. And Mr. Mark, who came in at the end and bought a a uh, Venom statue that I had I've had for a long time that. That thing looks very cool, and congratulations and everybody else. And uh, Saturday night, being up in Michigan, helped my friend celebrate his 10th anniversary and seeing Battery, the Metallica tribute band, and seeing Jeff from Flint up there. Certainly good seeing you, man. Very good seeing you. Um, and I'll see if I can grab you one of those shirts. Just working on that for you. But here's, uh, we've got Dark Knight's Death Metal, Multiverse's End. See so how this is. Got a great Michael Golden cover on it. Hopefully this is good. Uh, seems like some of the Dark Knight's metal books um, are being done just to just try to soak up some extra cash. I don't know if some of these books are truly needed or not. This is one of the uh, premium Three Jokers, Batman Three Jokers issue two covers. It's one of the premium covers. And if you... Uh, uh, when issue one came out, you bought all five. If you're signed up for the uh, for the one in 450 variant, you're still signed up. And just let people out there know if you haven't, if you haven't signed up yet, or if you haven't uh, taken advantage, come in. You need to buy all five covers from issue one, and then all five of issue two, and then issue three, and then you'll be in a drawing for the one in 450 variant. I still have some open spots, so certainly take advantage. Don't say, "Well, I never win anything." Gosh, when your odds are like 1 in 20 or 1 in 25, you've got pretty damn good odds. How can you not try that? You know, to use the, well, I don't win anything. Here's your chance. Here's your chance. Take a chance. You know, to win a book, 450, 1 out of 450, what's that thing going to be worth? 500, 600, 1,000 dollars? Not worth taking a risk on that. That's a hell of a great, you got great odds there. A lot better odds than trying to play the lottery. There's more of those Michael Golden covers. We've got three boxes, but there's only ten different DC titles this week. This is the cover B. Actually, you have to have more. Okay, they're up. They're upside down, or who knows. This is cover B on Legion of Superheroes number nine. It's kind of a, kind of a, uh, Boring cover, actually. I think it's kind of very boring. Nondescript. Lack of imagination. Here we've got cover B on Red Hood Outlaw number 49. We've got that. Only got a couple of those ordered. Didn't order many of those. Batman Superman Annual. There's only one cover to these. There you go. You got Mixiplex. You got Batmite making... Uh, Big Blue and Batman fight, and they've got all their villains up there, all giving the big thumbs down. Of course, Joker's the only one giving the thumbs down because he's just enjoying the hell out of it. It's like, man, I'm gonna, I need to start a war. Looks like these are more of the. Whoops, sorry about that. Smack the camera. My uh, producer's going to get all up, up my ass about that. More of those Joker covers. All right, there's more of those Batmans. And then this cover here, this is for, uh, this is Wonder Woman 1984, the movie adaptation. I know somebody out there that he told me he wants a dozen copies of this book. And we're going to have it waiting for you, Mr. KS. Uh, you know, you want your copies, you're going to get these copies. Look at this beautiful artwork on this. Man, Wonder Woman has never been represented so realistically before. 
you will believe that she's an Amazon and can go toe to toe and fight battles for hours. Look at her, man, outstanding. And I noticed something on the back. I guess this is got Batgirl and Joker. So this is going to be the giveaway card this time around. Let's see, we also have Batman the Joker, the War Zone. And there's got to be more of these someplace. These are cover A's. There's only three copies there. Obviously, uh, CSD, CSW has decided that they can be, they can slop, stop stuff. Because look, there's a... There's a red hood all by himself. Three copies. Can't even put them together. You guys are, uh, you guys, you guys suck. Wonder Woman 763, cover B. There's more. 763, I think that's Josh Middleton covers. And those are all Joker, three Jokers. And there's that. We're going to pause this and grab my neck. Okay, we're back here. It's cracked open. Paper, of course. And again, perfect example got two copies of this Harley Quinn cover now I ordered a lot more than two copies and then there's one of this cover so these three were together unacceptable somebody's letting their special cousin letting their special cousin work for them this week put your cousin Vinny in there he needs, so he needs a job. And yep, there is the giveaway cards this week for every copy that you buy. Ironically enough, the only the only ones that you buy that it doesn't count towards is the premium covers because those are given to me in packs of 25. And look, here's some others. Here we have two more. Here we have four more. Gosh, you could have put in all five of those together. And gosh, you could have put in all four of those together. And I want to say I've got a few more than that ordered too. But let's move on to it. This is the cover B. Batman 3 Jokers, you got Barbara on the front, so of course you're going to have Jason Todd on the last one there. And that last issue, man, was that thing something or else? And there's only three copies of this right there. Because then we have this cover with the Joker on it. So that's one of the, another one of the premium covers. And in between, uh, when I pause, I counted my shipments out, counted uh, comics out. It seems that uh, the uh, multi-universe, I'm missing copies. So those are in some other box somewhere. And here, do you think I only ordered two copies of the B cover of this? There's only two copies right there. Yep, somebody letting their special cousin work. For them. Oh, and here's two more of these bad girls. So it puts me at five. And then I see we have this is the B cover of Three Jokers. Those and these things are all globulated. No sense of order whatsoever. More of those. And the rest of these. So we're only missing 
one cover at this point. Ah, and I went to pick this up. I can feel there's something in between. Look, they're hiding promo posters, hiding promo posters in between, in between uh, pieces of cardboard. American Vampire, yep, that does come out this week. Ah, yes. Man, this was packed so damn well. We've got, there's a punchline special coming out. These are promos that are going to be given out. Looks like these may be the rest of my cover A's on Joker Warzone. I'm going to pause and grab the final box. Okay, final box. All right, I was wondering where my missing copies were. I had some of these that were missing. And... Be it. Those are my missing 10. See, so we got issue 10, John Constantine Hellblazer. That's in this week. We've got, oh, look, we've got Wonder Woman, which, okay, this stack here. Let's go down to the stack. Nope. Here's this by itself. So I've got this by all by its lonesome. I've got one more of these all by their lonesome. And then we got some Justice League Annual 2s. Right there. Trapped in the Hall of Justice. Looks like all these might be here. Let's see here. Those are all there. And it looks like here's some of the rest of my cover bees on Joker's Wild One. It's got uh, the goldfish on the front there. Goldfish with spoiler and with uh, the old bat girl, Cassandra, orphan. So, and then this is the fifth cover. For this week for Batman 3 Jokers. I'll show you all five covers at the end of the video. Looks like that's what these are here. Yep. Looks like that's what the entire stack there is. Okay. Crack open the other side because we're still missing the rest of those Wonder Womans. Uh, other comics as well, including these. See, I knew those short stacks weren't weren't all. I didn't order a lot of them, but I did order certainly more than what was sent. Me. Ah, and I see I was wrong about one of them. But here's some more of the Batgirl covers. Almost got it in her eye there. She almost got it in her eye. I was watching a Godzilla film this morning on Comet, Comet uh, TV that they've got the uh, English subtitles. So it's the original Japanese version. And I think it's Destroy All Monsters. And Godzilla's fighting the giant spider. I, I, I always butcher his name. And um, Little Boy and, and Baby Godzilla's watching. And the spider was shot his, his webbing, and they're like, got Godzilla, shot him in the eye. And don't you hate when that happens? But uh, here's some other comics. Here's more of these. So I did order more with uh, goldfish on the front. And we did have, look, one of these all by itself. Gosh. Gosh, Mickey. Here's some regular covers to Wonder Woman 
763. Here's the regular covers on Legion of Superheroes number 9. Again, kind of a boring cover there, I think. Here's the rest of the Red Hood Outlaw 49 covers with Bizarro. Looks like here's some more of the rest of the Wonder Woman 1984 movie adaptations. And I guess that film comes out this week, so how many of you guys are going to plan on seeing Wonder Woman? You know, let me know in the comments. Let me know if you uh, give a crap or not. I know Chaos is going. That he's going. He says he's going because he's got another vacation this week. Here's more Dark Knight's Death Metal Multiverse Universe End with the Michael Golden covers. Got a few more in here. And looks like I've got the rest of the Batgirl covers. I'm going to pause this quickly. Okay, before we look at the uh, Joker covers, we do have the variants here. This is the 1 in 25 variant for Batman 3 Jokers. I like this packaging that they put in here. I'm glad that they do it. I'm able to reuse this packaging to ship stuff out like the Grand Rapids or the Flint or London, Kentucky, or to, uh, you, know, you just never know, Rochester, Pittsburgh, Dallas, all kinds of places. Here's the 1 in 100. Some more of the 1 in 25s. Here's the Art Adams. 1 in 25 multi-universes end with a Captain Carrot and his amazing zoo crew that's dead. They're gone. But here are the covers for this week. For Batman 3 Jokers. If you do like these videos, as always, if you've not subscribed yet, please subscribe. Please like the video. Please share the video. And are you reading Batman 3 Jokers? What do you think of it so far? Other than that, thanks for watching. Have a great New Comics Wednesday on October 1st, 2020. The nightmares never end. There's always something to fear. Always something to fear.